so today I thought I would film a tag, which I haven't actually done before and I'm very excited. I've watched a lot of these on YouTube and I always love watching them because I think they're so funny. Um, so I decided to do a What's in My Bag. So this is my bag. I got it from Kate Hill ages ago and I am terrible with my bag because I never cleaned it out and there is so much rubbish in here and I've been planning to clean this out for like a thousand years and I just don't because I hate doing it. So we're going to go through bit by bit and you can see all the crap I carry around with me all the time. The first thing is hairbrush because I just got back from my boyfriend's house um, and I always take a hairbrush with me because he only has combs and stuff because boys don't brush their hair most of the time. Um, so there's that. Super exciting. We have a Mars bar wrapper because I eat at work sometimes and <laughs> I keep stuff in my bag. We have my wallet. So I got this wallet a few weeks ago from Bluebird, which is just like a kind of like the Woolworths. Okay, no, that's not gonna make sense to anyone American. It's the Walmart of wallet brands. It's just there. It's like the basic basic brand. Um, sorry if you own Walmart. Um, and then it just opens up like that and has all my stuff in it. Um, so I'll go through it because that's fun. So I've got my bank card. Um, I've got my train card, which is stupid. Mikey is stupid. If you live in Melbourne, you know what I'm talking about. I have my university ID. Look at sexy ass. I have my Medicare card, which is a healthcare card. I have my movie card. I have my Boost Juice card. I have my Woolworths card, a couple of other random cards, and I have my license, which is really sexy. I do have my P's, but I never drive because I don't have a car, which is depressing. Boom. Look at that sexy mug. It's just bad. And then I've got a whole bunch of crap in there, and I have absolutely no money at the moment because I spend it on pizza for lunch. Priorities. I have nowhere to put all this. Okay, it's going on the bed. So we have those two. Then I have my birth control pill. Controversial. I have a receipt for from last night. Bought a gingerbread house to make. Pringles and grapes. Health is important. That's why I got the grapes. Then I have a receipt for Dan Murphy's for a hundred and twenty-five dollars. Dan Murphy's is an alcohol shop, and uh, for a hundred and twenty-five dollars, um, because it was my birthday, and I also had to buy a friend a present for his twenty-first. I have an empty, oh no, one sad piece of gum packet. I have an empty packet of Tic Tacs, green apple, because green apple is my favorite flavor of anything ever. I have my keys. I have a whole bunch on here. That one is a USB. Um, I have my key for work and it has little robots attached to it. I don't work at a robot store, but it's cute. I have a lot of random bracelets because I tend to dump bracelets in my bag. Cool. Wondering where they went. I have another random bracelet. More rubbish. Toblerone rubbish. A Toblerone container. Can you tell I like junk food? More random crap. A drumstick wrapper, another bracelet, some broken headphones, including the cap. Yay! My beloved iPod, which has seen better days, but is still going strong. What was I last listening to? Anne Boleyn. Can't say that at all, but very good band. Probably shouldn't throw that. Another bracelet, and they're getting all sticky because there's like gum wrapping in there. And then about a thousand jubes. It's really gross. They're everywhere in my bag. I'm a little disgusted in myself right now. And we have another bracelet. How delightful. So moving on to the inside pocket where I have a smooshed box of tampons for when I get to my period. Yeah, let's talk about that. Then I have my middle pocket which carries stuff that I don't use a lot but that I might need. So I've got some fashion tape. I've got some Panadol for when I'm at work and as you can see I get really sore feet and stuff and I get sick all the time with fevers so I need it. I have some hand sanitizer which is actually moisturizing. Very important. Moisturize wherever you can. I have two lip glosses. One is a random one that I actually bought from work so I don't really want to show you in case you work out where I work but it's like that color and it's watermelon and it smells so good. 
because it smells like watermelon. And then I have another random Maybelline one I had years ago in rhinestone pink. It was like my favorite lip gloss when I was like 12 and I still have it and I don't care. <coughs> I have some Ray-Bans because I can't wear any other sunglasses because oversized ones make me look like a fly. I have some deodorant in case I forget that day. I have some sea salt hair texturizing spray and I have some iron tablets because I'm kind of anemic and I need them. Then in the next pocket we have another bracelet, another bracelet, another bracelet. It's all bracelets I swear. More headphones, don't think these work either. Uh, top coat, nail polish, and two half empty packets of soothers which are throat lozenges. Charmer. And then in another pocket, oh, I found my lost pack of Levlin. I lost a pack of birth control and I didn't know where it went. And it screwed me up because I had two left. And I had to switch to another pack so I'm always like two ahead. How could you? Thank you internet. You have solved a mystery today. And that is actually everything in my bag. I don't carry a whole lot. It's mostly rubbish. Oh wait. Two more bracelets. But that is basically everything that I carry around with me on a daily basis. And of course my phone, which looks like that. Um, but that is it. And then whatever else I can shove in there in the meantime. So I hope you enjoyed looking through my lovely but slightly old and sad Kate Hill bag to see what I carry around. Um, there's an outside pocket as well, but I know for a fact there's nothing in there. I don't use all my pockets. Do we really need that many pockets? Be honest with yourself. Anyway, I hope you guys have a wonderful few days and I'll talk to you soon. Bye.